back to the House of Hughes. I hope you enjoyed my little intro today. I haven't been showing you guys my food very much lately. I don't know how many of you are actually interested in that, but I did make a New Year's resolution to eat more micronutrient dense foods. You guys know I love balance. I eat all things in moderation, but I think my body could use a little bit more whole food in my diet. So that is my goal. So I am partially holding myself accountable by showing you guys, but that little bagel sandwich that I made today, it's a staple. I have it like every single morning. It's so delicious. So if you guys enjoy seeing what I eat, let me know and I can totally film full days of eating for you guys. Today's video is much more exciting than that though. I have got my little guy right next to me. Beckham's in his high chair and we are actually going to be doing two things today. We're gonna to be trying something new and I'm also going to be giving you guys a major walking update, which I know you are going to love and be so excited for. I know that I've shown you guys like little snippets of Beckham walking in his gait trainer since I did my last video, completely dedicated to his walking. And he has made so many improvements, but today I'm going to do like a full dedicated video on how he's doing in his gait trainer, the improvements that he's made. And I think it is going to blow your guys' mind. I mean, he has been working so hard. I'm so excited to just show him off today and let him show you guys his skills. In addition to that, we are also doing something super exciting that has to do with food. You guys know Beckham is eating only baby food right now. That's what works for us. He obviously has major aversion still to any texture. And what we decided to do with his feet Eating therapist is eliminate having texture with the foods that he's really safe with. I think I can hear Blakely. She must be awake from her nap. So I'm going to have Hunter run and grab her really quick. But Beckham used to do like cottage cheese mixed with baby food. And as we got more and more cottage cheese mixed into it, then we would lose baby food even by itself because I think it would just scare him and make him feel unsafe. We've decided to just try textured foods completely on their own. It is gonna be a little more challenging for him, but then we know that we're not going to lose his staple of baby food that's like smooth and safe and we know we can get him to eat that and count on it. So I went and picked up a little Gerber like baby food. They just sell these at Walmart, but these are SpaghettiOs, like SpaghettiOs basically, little spaghetti rings for babies. I'm gonna put this in the food processor so I can make it even more smooth than it already is and see how he does. And I wanted to show you guys because I don't really show you very often when we do something like brand new and how difficult it can be for him. But I wanna show you guys just kind of how he reacts. I'm not sure how he's gonna do, but I know he's gonna try his best and that's literally all that matters to me. And when it comes to food, I feel like I have a big responsibility to know when to push him, when to play it safe. And it's been a while since we tried something new, huh babe? We're gonna try it and I wanted to try it with you guys and take you guys kind of along with us so you can see how he does. Here's to hoping even if he doesn't do perfect today, I know we're just gonna keep trying and he's gonna get it down eventually. We're gonna go ahead and throw this in the food processor and then we are gonna get this little guy in his gait trainer. I'm actually gonna have dad offer the food. Oh, and let's get that little bib on him. Beckham is used to dad feeding him right now and I wanna give Beckham just the most comfortable environment, whatever he's used to. So as you guys can tell, I pureed this. I also added some water, but you can see there's just texture unlike baby food, but I'm hoping it doesn't freak him out too badly. Quit, 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 quit. Quit, 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 quit. <laughs> You're so silly. We're gonna go really, 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 really slow. Good job. Good job. High five. High five. Good job. Good job. Good, 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 good. Oh my gosh, he didn't gag. Good, 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 good. That is amazing. So what's really important when I feed him and try new things is to distract him with like high fives or anything that'll make him smile or laugh. He knows whether or not he liked it and we're gonna see right here if he takes another bite. You did so good, Bubba. It's okay. Take all the time you need, babe. I know. 
Was it gross? Yeah. Just gonna clean that off yeah. Look. Oh, made it worse. Awesome, go down. <laughs> okay. Bubba's? You want more? Good job, Bubba. Good job. I know. It's hard when it's different, but you did so good on your first bite, babe. Beckham is also very, very smart. He knows what color his food typically is. So it's helpful and working in our favor that this food is the same color as most of his baby food. Oh, oh. you're using your hand to comfort you? You just woke up from a nap, so we know you're not tired, Bubba's. No, we know you're not tired. You're hungry. Come on, little man. Good job. So as you guys can tell, he's just kind of nervous. Wow, you're so handsome. Oh my word, he's so cute. I'm so distracted. <laughs> Look at you. You mean mugging he's it? Like, Give me the good food. All right, hmm. we did good. So good we job. don't want to force him. The last thing that we want to do is like force him because that's obviously going to create a really negative connotation with us giving him anything new or different or anything that has texture. So we are going to just move on with the feed, give him his normal baby food, and we'll just continue at the beginning of every feed. We'll probably, let's keep that in the fridge doll, yeah. and we'll just heat it up to make it closer to room temperature because we don't want to throw him off the temperature either. But we will just continue offering one bite, and if he never opens up for a second, then we'll just move on to his normal food. But you guys know, eventually he's gonna open up for a second bite and a third bite, and today that was his best, and that's okay. Good job. We grabbed this food, and we tried to bite. Tried to bite. Good job. Good job, Bubba's. Good job. No, 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 no. High five. High five. High five. Good job on the high five, Bubba's. Good job. Oh, you know. Good job. You come in. Hey, nice and gentle. We'll go slow. Good job. Amazing, Becca. Good job, Bubba's. High five. Oh, high, high five. five. <gasps> Good. High five. High five.
putting him in his gait trainer. You're gonna go get him. So he had trouble even moving it, and now he's so much more energetic to be in it. As you guys can tell, he's like bouncing, and he's able to propel himself forward, which is so exciting. And I also love that he makes intentional movement. Like when we put a ring in front of him, he will purposefully try and grab it. Yes, good baby! Oh, sorry, we got too close. It's been really exciting just to see the differences and the improvement that he's made since we got this gait trainer. When we first put him in it, he was sobbing. Were you crying? Do you know I'm talking about you? And he just likes it so much more now. He can propel himself forward. He's utilizing it so much more. And he's just overall so much happier and making so much progress. Thank you guys for praying for him and just for always asking about how his walking is going. It's it's really cool to look back on like updates and see how far he's come since I last talked to you guys about it. So the next steps would really just be to see him move it even more than he is now and to see him isolate his feet and start taking steps. But I know that we'll get there and I'm just excited to see what he accomplishes this year. Hi baby! Thanks for hanging out with us today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up for Mr. Beckham. And hit that red subscribe button down below. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Can you say bye? Mwah.